game of OBS. Oh, bullshit. Oh, bullshit? No. I have a new abbreviation called Bob. Bob. You know what Bob <laughs> stands for? <laughs> he, he, go, he goes, he goes, Oh my, oh no. and now it's dropping frames like crazy. What the hell? Did the, Sparrow said that the stream zonk out. Let me message him. OBS. Disconnect. This is the first time something like this, this ever time. happened, and now it's dropping frames like crazy. What do I, I do? Hate spelling. I, yeah, it's oh, it stopped. It stopped. It stopped. It stopped. So, Brandon, bunch of bullshit. It's close, Sparrow. It stands for bag of bullshit. Have a boss. Is Autumn still coming over? Yeah. What? No, we don't suck at spelling, we suck at auto correcting. I was just asking! Can I not just say her name? Because my friends are streaming right now. The way you said it. I, oh I said it normally. You did not say Yes, I did. Shut your mouth. I said it normally. It's not, it's not spilling. I think it's it's more of a... Twitch auto-correcting. Which auto-correcting? Because I'm pretty sure the G and the C are nowhere near each other on the typing, so... I know I typed it right. I did not that type back to full snip. <laughs> back. Bow. Until until the Easter special, we can find the Easter extra extra large. We still gotta do that. We gotta go to the extra large and do the Easter egg special for Easter. Baby oh, so you're gonna task Nick with going and getting all the Easter eggs and fairies? Or at least Joby the egg. Because last year he did the holiday specials, but he never did the Easter. The Ogni <laughs> tries to catch those damn fairies. Yeah, he does. I, I think Brandon here is the only one that that will that ever do the race mode, probably. On uh, Shrek on Xbox? Yeah, I yeah. was the only one that completed uh, it 100%. <laughs> Except for maybe Adam. He says a Adam's expressed how he wants to try to 100 percent it in the whole world you i think i think you're the, probably the first one to do it on youtube oh god damn it no i'm the se like the second one there's Whoa. a guy named Zor Z zora the goro or no spyro like the gerudo spyro the Gerudo. he did it first oh yeah. hey thanks to new thank the, for, thank the, thanks to new followers on twitch <laughs> But really, you figure out what email you want to use? Yo, idiot! And type it in this. Type it in the uh, Skype chat, not the not the Twitch chat, obviously. What? Type your YouTube in the in the Skype chat. Type my YouTube. <laughs> email. Type your email. <laughs> I did. I sent it to your personal messaging. System. Oh, okay. Like, let's see. Like, like where is it at? <laughs> I guess Skype didn't give you a notification, or it didn't send. I'm not sure. I, I, I was waiting for the in the group chat. Like, <laughs> oh no. I just sent it to your personal chat. God. You're fighting a big worm, Schnick. I know I'm fighting a goddamn big ass worm, but the camera's fighting me. 
Alright, I gave you power. Give you some power. Oh my god, and the plants. The plants? They may as well be fucking DSP's plants he didn't take care of. <laughs> <clears throat> you know what would be funny, Snick? Oh, oh. Go. Snick. What? Uh. If I met DSP in real life, I would, I would take a photo of him and caption it. I take a photo with the worst human on earth. What? Are you kidding me? <laughs> is DSP the worst human on earth now, or is that Logan Paul? Probably Logan Paul. DSP is pretty up there, but still. Oh my god. Kill him. Kill him! It looks like a, uh, like a praying mantis. Uh, don't remind me of those disgusting things. Ah! Oh, s oh, it's, it's, hey, Sparrow, are you still in chat? I think it was oh. you or Pokesaurus who told me about it. But, I, I, I rewatched The Walking With beast thing, and I saw that those ants kill that bird. Baby bird. Oh, the baby baby terror birds. The baby terror. Those giant red ants killed the baby terror bird. Hatch hatching out of the egg. This That's goddamn bullshit. Oh, that's the one I think it was you, Pokesaurus, that told me about it. <laughs> I, well, it, I would uh, hope Pokesaurus is obsessed with birds because birds are considered evolved from dinosaurs. Technically, they're not evolved from. They still are dinosaurs. See, exactly. That's oh the my Cletus. god, the plants! So, I might eat some dinosaur. I'm hungry for that. Actually, now I'm hungry for dinosaur now. Oh, a nice. Oh, you fucker. You fucker. I want some nice crispy dinosaur. Eat some reptar bars. Kill the fucker. Yes. Oh my god. So one boss down, 20 to go. Two bosses down. Ooh. Yay, boss killed. Where's your heart container? <laughs> it's in Baby's Kisses land. Oh, it isn't in Zelda. It's like, I'm used to killing boss, get heart, get heart, kill boss, get heart container. There's a goddamn power up. <coughs> the Metroid Prime symbol. <coughs> Oops, I God. broke it. Oh, but let's see. Dying again. Hang on. What the hell? Oh, Samus has full armor back. Yay, armor. No bikini mode. <laughs> there we go. Oh, so now we can go to areas that are covered in heat. Well, I want to go this way. And if we die... Holy goddamn, if we died there. You know, I think Sam I think Metroid was the very first... Wasn't, like... Like, I think, wasn't Samus supposed to be the very first female hero? Very progressive for the day. At least one of the more famous ones, I believe. And oh, we got some health. Thank God. So, so Nita's wrong. There, uh, there are female heroes in in video gaming. 
Curiously, I do not remember a single video where frickin' Anita mentioned Samus. Kind of strange, huh? Because he was like the very first female hero, I think. Well, then again, Anita's a known liar. What? I need... Uh, yeah, but my my favorite... I thought my favorite... What's your favorite... What's, what is your favorite Anita moment? My favorite Anita moment? Well... Well, the whole VidCon controversy where she first attacked Sargon when he was only there to just watch her discussion. Then she bullied Boogie after he noted how women's rights should be human's rights, which was a pretty mature statement. <laughs> Oh, we're talking about Anita, Anita Sarkeesian now? Yeah, but your, honestly... Your, your favorite moments from her. Honestly, my favorite moment from her was when she claimed in early videos that she did not like playing games, and she hadn't really ever played games. Then, later on, just to make herself look good in front of people who actually did play games, she showed an apparent childhood photo of herself playing Super Nintendo, after claiming that she never played one. Wow. What's funny is that, um... I think nobody trusts the website Polygon no more. Yeah. It's my favorite video moment. It's... I made a podcast about it last... Two years, three, few years ago. It was where... She literally went to the United Nations... And asked the United... The committee and asked them... To make hating her on the internet a crime. Talking bad about her on the internet a crime. What's you funny win. is that clearly that... What's funny is that clearly they didn't implement nothing. So they probably just... Be, they were probably just nice to her to save face. And now they probably don't even remember who she is. <laughs> it's like... Be like, sure, Anita. You know, we were, we were worried about, you know, war. You know, and, and hunger issues in the world. You know, and... And nuclear nuclear things, but we're gonna we're gonna get right on to making you not being hated on the internet. We'll get right on that, Anita. It's just the UN. Yeah. Talk about ego. <laughs> well, she does have an inflated ego because, for one thing. When Boogie was making his... What I was trying to get at with the whole Polygon thing... Was that when Boogie made his speech... Um... Every... All the other... He was notably the only panelist who was a man. Everyone else was... Including Anita was obviously a woman. After he was done with his speech... He got a roaring applause from the audience... Supposedly, none of the other panelists applauded him, but from what I understand, the other panelists, except for Anita, at least respected his opinion. Anita herself, she immediately got this smug look on her face the moment he no noted how the problem was not just women's rights was not the only problem, and that men's rights were a problem, and that it should be a human rights problem. Like, as soon as Boogie brought that up, Anita got this dirty look on her face, and literally throughout most of Boogie's speech, she was literally, she didn't even look him straight in the eye. She was just looking down, probably on her phone, not even listening to him. Wow. And then after the panel was done... She took him backstage and called him fucking stupid. Word for word. He got that on camera? Unfortunately, he didn't, but there were eyewitnesses. Yeah, that one was, like, probably the worst. <laughs> yeah, and he was actually... He actually made a response video, kind of... He was, like, trying to hold back tears. He was saying, sorry, sorry, sorry. But people in the comments were saying, don't defend her, she's a bitch. <laughs> Yeah. 
And funny thing is, nobody's mentioned Anita since that incident until she recently visited Bioware. Huh. Um, but the reason why I bring up Polygon and why nobody trusts them anymore is because they did an article where they not only covered the incident with Anita and Boogie, they painted Anita as a hero. The hero of the people. Wow. The hero we need, not the hero we want. That is a great <laughs> I swear to God, swear to God, like, my freaking dog ain't gonna be giving no baby's kisses. <laughs> <laughs> he's probably gonna, he's probably gonna give that sad, if she actually walked into my house, he'd probably give that sad look and he would just cower with me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to find the damn room where, oh my God. Because I, I want to go into one of the heat rooms. The heat room? Oh, 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 oh. Never mind, I can't go into that heat room. I need a power-up, so I need to... So, I need to go back. I need to take the elevator. So, God damn it, I just wasted some more time. So, it just went straight on the elevator, but I did not. Why didn't you go on the elevator? Because baby's kisses. Speaking of that, is, your, is the baby there? No, the baby's upstairs. He's probably gonna cry to me real soon. He wants to go for a walk. <laughs> ah, walk. So, you, you, have you heard from heard, heard from Mario today? Have I? Yeah. He tried calling me like four times last night while I was asleep, but no, uh, I haven't heard from him today. Uh, oh no, the dog! Your doggy's scared or something? I know no, what she's happened. Whimpering because someone, uh, new people are in the house, so she's got to freak out about it. She's got to freak out about new people. That's that's what my dog does anytime Uncle Wally takes him for a vacation. <laughs> Like, don't leave me alone, this guy! No! No, he does it because he's excited. Oh. Because babies kisses. Does, does your dog excited or scared? Brandon. My dog? Yeah. yeah he's scared of new people or excited of new people? She gets excited. I think my dog was scared of new people when I had it. I'm not new people, but strangers like it. It, it barked like, sh like intruder, intruder, bark, 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 bark. <laughs> yeah. Like whenever my cousins came for Halloween, they always barked at them. And whenever the water meter guy came to read the meter in the backyard, it, it knew. It like, <laughs> like, like, oh, sorry, dog barking, like barking. Oh, like water meter guy's here. Dog's barking. <laughs> wow. The ogre. The ogre fart. I think I might have to do shitty RPG. I swear to God, Mario needs to play that game for my birthday. No exceptions. <laughs> yeah. And if he's like, oh, I have too many projects, it's my freaking birthday. Play it. What the hell? You gonna, you gonna do a shitty RPG on Twitch? Impact reduction. Hell no, that shit needs to stay on YouTube. It's not gonna inf infect Twitch. <laughs> Virus. Oh, I, yeah, was, I, I, I was recently oh. re-watching um, the PS2 shitty RPG. I, I was too. The one with Macho Mario. <laughs> you were? When? But it was like... A couple weeks ago. Oh. It's like... Weird. It's not, it's, not, it's not letting me friend you. Oh what? my god. Sam trying just to friends, got a bullet. I'm trying to friend... I'm trying to be friends. Nick was not letting me. On. Because Twitch. Baby, 
these kisses. Twitch? Yeah, I, I, I'm already friends with you on Twitch, but I'm not friends with Snick. This is Shrek. You almost died there, Snick, it looked like. Yeah, well, I have a couple of health bars. Magmore Caverns. A lava level. Well, because, of course, there's later gonna be an ice level. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, now I'm friends with him. I, I am friends with him. It's weird. Shrek number two. Shrek number three looks like clay. I killed a lizard. Good job. Shrek souls. <laughs> That's what happens when Shrek puts on armor and freaking fights Horn C and Smog. Yeah. The difference between Shrek souls and Dark Souls, though, is uh, Shrek is able to kill them both at the same time with his deadly fart. <laughs> Imagine if the two of them died like that. <laughs> <laughs> um, and then Shrek, Shrek picks up Smog's hammer and runs around like a crazy maniac. Oh so Snick, in, in your opinion, who's more powerful, Universe 1 or Universe 2 Shrek? Universe 2, because he freaking takes Merlin as a pet and harnesses <laughs> his powers to the point where Merlin dies. <laughs> He's got magic on his side. Shit. You've got, you've got, we've got to have magic. Magic money. Bob the Baker. <laughs> Bob the goddamn Baker with the crabs. Can he, can he fry it? Oh my god, the crab. Does it literally grab you and throw you out? Yep. And can I kill the fucker? No, I can't. And it's stuck. It's stuck? Yeah, it's stuck. Look at this. Samus, kill it. Or scan it. Kill the whatever. Kill the whatever. Yo! Up oh, there! I thought I dropped you in there. Go back. Oh, thank you for freeing me, too. <laughs> oh my god! Ugh. No, 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 no. So what? What? So what? What are they? What are they making in the background with all the banging? It's called uh, hamburger pizza. Hamburger pizza. Needs a hammer. Needs, needs a hammer. <laughs> da 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 da. I bet they want to eat this too. Oh oh oh! Yes, I did it. Ha ha! I got through. Hooray! And we have another elevator. Oh, it's the elevator to the ice world. Drop down. So, Brandon, I am going to have a daily onion segment on the podcast. Yeah. I'm going to talk about retarded experiences when I was at theme parks. Yeah. Sure, we already had theme parks as a main topic, but I don't think I told retarded middle school schnicks or elementary school schnick stories from when I was actually there. Instead, I only <laughs> told the miserable stories, including goddamn. Wow. Park. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Babies, redneck mode. Ouch. Does, does someone does someone hit Samus? Oh, abuse, abuse. 
Yeah, Samus is not goddamn Anita. She can take it. She's got a big power armor suit. That Anita's like Samus would probably be like people like Anita make me sick. Because you know there actually are feminists that dissociate themselves from Anita saying that she's an insult to feminism. So they're probably a real feminist, you know, because, like, the first and second wave, they actually, you know, fought for real rights instead of fake rights. <laughs> it's funny, because anytime real feminists confront yeah, Anita, like, she just ignores them. Yeah. I think, she, I think she tries her best to not outright insult real feminists, because if she did, then people would know she's full of shit. She would lose her credibility. <laughs> really? <laughs> I mean, she's always bad-mouthing men, so if she was caught bad-mouthing a woman, Jesus Christ, that would probably hurt her reputation big time, especially if people saw it as abuse. There's a lot uh, of women that are anti-Anita, anti-feminist. Yeah, I've seen a couple of them. My favorite oh is my God. Like, like, I think, I told you before, like, like, first they fought for the right to vote, which they needed. Second, second, the next they fight for job rights, which they needed, and they got that. And now, and now they're fighting, now these fighting for the right for them not to be made fun of. <laughs> I guess. How many times have okay you died? What? How many times have you died on this playthrough? None. None? None. Are you on easy Yay. mode or hard mode? I don't think or there is, is a difficulty. There isn't difficulty select. I don't think so. Oh my god. The ogre tries to catch those damn fairies. So there's so there's no cage to critical mode in this game. No. Or birth Ow. by state critical mode. The one thing that is annoying about this area is that the turrets always respawn, and they, they're heavy hitters. Right, there's several doors we can enter, including the portal to the ice world, looks like. What are you doing, man? Uh, will you choose door number one, door number two, or door number three? Brandon! Door number three. Brandon. Brandon's being called. Fuck me! Brandon! What? Look up Ty's thing for him so he can play. To what? Your TV there. I was gonna use it though. Okay, well, look it up for Ty. Looks like Cursey. It looks like Potty Mouth Kid needs to play his video games. Mm -hmm. Damn video oh, game. Smash like, video game. Like, here, Ty, I'll give you a Pepsi Fire if you leave me alone. <laughs> uh, I think Pepsi Fire got discontinued. <laughs> it was so gross. <laughs> like, honestly, that was like the worst drink I've ever uh, had. <laughs> Cinnamon cola is gross. Brandon, I have to ask, what? my stream later today, should I play Sonic Adventure or Fear? Uh, I guess Sonic Adventure. Because, honestly, I'm thinking I have to finish Fear first, but no. You know what? Fuck Fear. <laughs> I say stream more so your RPG editing. I could, well, there's that too, but I have a long weekend to do that. Because, Brandon, I already said I'm going to be home Monday because I my class got canceled. Yeah. So, and then four days at school, spring break, a whole week off. Nice. So, plenty of time to do shit. So my game keeps. But hey, I do want to really, I really do want to stream that game because you know it's funny. I put all the three D games in my schnick timeline. The, f the first game, the first adventure, takes place the same year as Cage 1, I think. It does? I think so. Wow. So while Sora, while Sora's going around the thing, that stuff's, that stuff's happening. What? 
I said, so, so, so while Sora's there on the other world, that, that, yeah, that thing is happening in your timeline? Pretty much. The original MGS also takes place at the same time. Someone was getting a phone call. That was me. Vandalia Your ringtone be... almost sounded like my my phone's default ringtone. It's funny because I think Vandelia said his internet might go out any moment. I was afraid I was gonna go out any moment because earlier today, like there was a lot of nasty Ray. wind. Yeah, what do you my... want? Go oh, set him up on the big TV. That way you don't have to give up your TV. What TV? My TV. Go set him up on my TV. All the way downstairs. Yes, he's gonna play on the big TV. Do you have an HDMI available for it? I don't know. You'll have to look. I don't know anything about that shit. Go do. Fine, I'll just steal your PlayStation 3's Go HDMI. Do. Okay, I'm saving the game. Let's Podcast is at 10, Vandalia, What's right? What's for dinner? Yeah, what like... Uh, oh. An hour and 45 minutes. Okay. Stop talking. More do it. Baby. You're gonna, poop, you're gonna poop into bread and serve it for us? Yes, I am. If you don't do that, I'm out of here. Right now, <laughs> <laughs> well, you heard it first, Vandelia. Apparently, I'm I'm having poop bread for dinner tonight. <laughs> no, that's like what my that's talking. Brandon. Doing. What, Schneck? Your mom said you're having poop bread. That's almost similar to what my mom would say. Anytime, anytime I she's in a bad mood, and I ask her what dinner is. Her answer is this: shit. <laughs> I have a feeling both our moms yeah. would get along. Teach Ty, yeah, before right, you're I'll gone, teach Ty, teach Ty to do it himself. Here, Ty, here's how you do it. Now do it yourself now. <sighs> teach him. I gotta go to the bathroom and get... No, no bathroom, but I gotta get a drink, and probably the baby's gonna be begging for a walk. All right. All right. All right. I also entertain the troops while everyone's gone. So, everybody who's, who's still watching... I think that's nobody now. Hey! Achievement completed. Who watches the watchers? What is that? Awesome! I got an achievement! Who watches the watchers? Reach three average viewers in the last 30 days. Hooray! Path to affiliate. Interesting. So it begins. Thankfully, the yeah. baby is distracted by my sister. Sis. Hey. 50 followers. Oh, I can't go here yet. I need the double jump. I got it while you're gone. I got an achievement on Twitch. How so? 
what it is. Uh, uh, called Who Watches the Watchers reached three average viewers in the last three days. Wow. Oh. God damn baby's kisses. Interesting. Okay, we're back, and now the damn turrets are probably going to be here. Alright. No fucker. There's got to be a way up. So have you read my Schnick story timeline recently? Yeah. Not recently, I read it yesterday. Okay. Because I made more changes to it. Ooh. Um... It's funny, it feels like most franchises I'd have to put around the time Cage 1 occurred, but Resident Evil I had to put, like, a bit earlier. So what made you put K-8 as the default time- default zero- because I feel like that's when all the worlds become more closely connected. <laughs> okay, it makes sense. Um, also, it's because the events of Cage 3 are supposed to be on epic proportions. I wanted to line it up with all the other games having their epic storylines kind of at the same point where it feels like, oh, everything is at stake. <laughs> That's the primary reason why I put Resident Evil 11 years before Cage 1, because Resident Evil 6 is like a global pandemic kind of thing that gets averted. Is this on the GameCube? It is the GameCube version. I do have the Wii version, but um, I think it was either Mario or Brandon, but they just said play the GameCube version. And I'm trying Any to reason? figure out. So, so how, you got the 50, the 50 plus, and so now you just need the, the 30 days of viewers? Of constant viewing people? Unidentified flying ogre. Oh, shit. Ah! Oh, the lights are flickering. Oh, That's no good. Yeah, I don't... The lights are still flickering. I wonder the difference is between a, an affiliate and a partner on Twitch. God damn it. The lights just flickered a little bit. That's not a good sign. So we might be getting disconnected real soon. Uh-oh. Because if the power okay. goes out, then fuck me. Because we are. Uh, never stop learning and enjoy the randomness. Because I can't get my catchphrase. God damn this wind. Then again, only the lights flickered. If if there really was a bit of an outage, wouldn't my TV have flickered too? Let's see, let's see, have a surge protector on your TV. 
Huh. Oh, oh uh, my god, this is idiotic of me. Get up there. Went the wrong way. Oh, wait a fucking minute. There's another door that I can enter, like on the other side. If I can get to it. Oh, it is right here. Okay. Yes! Or at least I have somewhere to go. For at least a few seconds. Oh, lovely fire. So it looks like all that, the flickering was just a power surge. It does? Awesome. What? What? The flickering was just a power surge? I didn't say that. So what do you think it was? I have no idea what it was. I said, Maybe the reason your TV didn't go out because maybe you have a, I said maybe you have a power surge protector on your TV. That's why it didn't flicker. Uh, is that those four? Is it power surge protectors are four for surges? Protect you from short. I thought that the, the surge protectors were four. Uh, but but lights don't have power surge protectors, but TVs do. Samus is very flexible. All that for a missile expansion. Oh, damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. You've, you've got the missiles. You've got the lava. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, no wonder it feels like a magnet, because they literally do have, like, a magnet ability to pull me in. Might be a Twilight... It's like Twilight Princess magnet series. <laughs> uh, Alright, well, at least... Here we go. And I'm gonna wait for the flames. Let's see. Alright, I get the feeling that we're not going to be able to progress much farther. Oh, we have another elevator, and there was another freaking flickering light. Uh, good and bad. Again. Log in my thing yet. Oh, my God. Nope, still can't, still can't log in the website. You can't log in to Twitch? No, to my cable, my internet website. Oh. For my internet server. So I can pay the damn bill. Hmm. Why, are they down? Yeah, the website's down. Of course. It's always down at the most inconvenient time. Ow, oh, goddamn. It says the bill was due yesterday. <laughs> oh. On fucker, yes. 
trying to hope it lasts for the podcast at least. Yeah. Before they're like, you know what? You know what? Fuck this. I'm done. Ooh, it was the wool. Ha 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 ha. As they turn off your internet. <laughs> I think I might end the stream soon, though. Yeah, we got. We got. We got wrap, you got to wrap it up soon so we can get ready for the podcast. Yeah. Well, I'm gonna save with Samus here. She's in her spaceship. Save the game. Okay. Mm -hmm. Alright, I'm gonna wrap this up. Alright, thanks everybody for watching. Uh, join us. I hope maybe we can do some more streaming here tomorrow. We can watch the podcast in about an hour and a half. And never stop learning and enjoy the randomness. Bye-bye.